Eric E-R-I-K Burse B-U-R-S-E Public Information Officer for the Texas Department of Public Safety. Okay. Yep, there you go. We have a two vehicle crash uh, which resulted in two fatalities. Uh, we have a sewer worker who was working on the sewer lines and was struck by another vehicle. Okay, tell me in detail in more detail what happened or how it sure. happened. Um, the witnesses stated that the sewer worker was behind the pump truck clearing the lines when another vehicle disregarded the cones and struck the victim pinning him against the pump truck. Do we have any ages on the victims yet? We do not have ages on the victims at this time. We're working on that right now. So we just got the pump truck and the vehicle, the one vehicle involved? We have the pump truck and the one vehicle involved. The driver of the suspect vehicle also did not survive the crash. He died up on impact. All right. Coming up on, you know, many people know the pullover for red lights, but red lights, and there, there's more than just red lights. There is more than just red lights. There's construction workers, there are emergency management people that are out on the roadways, and we preach that when you see these lights, when you see these traffic cones, when you see these signs, decrease your speed, pay attention to your surroundings, change lanes safely when you can, and keep your speed decreased until you've passed the construction zone or the workers out performing their duties every day. Got it, good.